Welcome back. I'm your guest host for the hour, Nisi Nash Bex. And I am here with Malia Kiley and Ernie Hudson. And I am excited to try my hand at a signature daytime talk show cooking segment. <laughs> Maybe more importantly, eating, because that's my jam. <laughs> Our next guest is a huge success in the baking world. Nearly 20 years ago, she opened her first bakery, and today she has, count them, 26 locations. <laughs> From Susie Cakes, let's say hi to Susie Sarich. Thank you. Thank you. This is Ernie and Malia. Yeah. <laughs> hey guys. So tell me, where does your passion for baking come from? It comes from both of my grandmothers, Mildred and Madeline. They lived across the alley from each other in Chicago, and I grew up with them baking in their kitchen. Well, I'm excited because you know why? My cooking, all my cooking is done in the bedroom, so I yeah. need to get... <laughs> I said it. I said it. Yeah. All right. So I'm excited to okay. get in here and figure this out. Now, it Perfect. looks like we're making bars. What, what makes them yeah. such a standout? So this is a seven layer bar, which some people call them Dolly Madison's or magic bars, but almost everybody had a version of this growing up. All right, Perfect. so All right, what let's do we get do? started. Okay, so first we're gonna do is we're gonna make the base crust. So we each have a bag of graham crackers, okay? And we're gonna crush them up, okay? So use your rolling pin, everybody grab your pin, <laughs> okay? And just start this. This is comedy. You know you know yeah. you always see in the sitcoms, they like, let this me is tell true. you something. This is true, but it's true. Okay, so you can just, if you're angry, you can do more, less, gentle. And and you want to... <laughs> this is kind of You got it, right? It's, very, it's really good. Really yeah. therapeutic. Yeah, so you want to do that until it gets like sand, like the texture of sand, okay? Yeah. So once you get that all crunched up, which we don't really have a ton of time for, um, you would take melted butter and mm -hmm. sugar and make your crust. Okay, so okay. that's already been done for us. Got it. Because we, we don't have a lot of time here. But we're gonna, the next layer is you take sweetened condensed milk. Oh, this is and the next layer? This is the next layer. Oh, so I just this you, was something. That's coming soon. Oh, personally. okay, sorry. <laughs> um, and you wanna just drizzle back and forth about, no, uh, you know, like crisscross applesauce. Like, back, back like and that, forth. Like that, okay? So just a little bit like that. Back and then back reverse. Forth. Hey. So it looks something like that. Ooh. Okay, perfect. No, that's enough. That's enough. Oh. Okay, so. <laughs> that's enough. Okay, not the whole thing. Not oh, the whole thing. Oh. Okay, I'm sorry to make that clear. Okay, great. Um, okay, so next we're going to put in the, um, hang on, we're going to use that later, um, our filling. So the really cool thing about these bars, I know in the new year, some people want to be healthier, and I know it seems funny to talk about health around this, but I'm going to give a substitute for everything we use. So there are, there are pecans, so if you mm -hmm. don't like pecans, you can use peanuts or um, almonds or cashews or any, any other nut you like. Mm -hmm. We have butterscotch chips. If you don't like butterscotch, you can just double down on the chocolate chips. How is it, Ernie? Yeah. Ernie's already into it. Oh, it's good. <laughs> um, um, then we have coconut. I use sweetened coconut. You could use unsweetened. And then last but not least, um, we have chocolate chips. And um, it's actually national semi-sweet chip day. So oh, wow. we're going to be using those today. Okay, great. Awesome. Okay, so we've already mixed all the ingredients up here. So what we're going to do is take our wooden spoon and just um, put them into your bar pan. Guys, we're going to just kind of lightly these in. We're spread lightly, those around. What are we doing? I want to sound like yeah. I like your voice. Lightly We're gonna spread. Lightly, lightly spread, spread these lightly around. Spread. <laughs> See? Oh my! Um, Look at this. There we go. And this is also an easy recipe, like you can make with your kids if it's a really cold snow day, or you know, kids are out of school. So this is kind of just a fun little thing that everybody can do, and you really can't mess it up. You yeah. are jacking yeah. up my whole life yeah. right now because <laughs> I told you all I do is cook in the bedroom. Yeah, now I'm gonna have to make you this. You can make this. Yeah. I'm, well, you can. Yeah. You can. Please. <laughs> All right, and then we want to take whatever whatever uh, condensed milk you have, repeat your pattern, or whatever you've got left will be fine. Hmm. But kind of getting that crisscross back and forth. No one has any left, so we'll just we'll look at my I have some we'll, left. We'll look at my Look we'll at look me, at teacher. Head. Okay. I have some left. Perfect. Awesome. Okay, perfect. And then you would just pop this in the oven for 20 minutes at 350. Oh. Super easy. Wow. Okay. Do you eat it warm? No, you've got to let it, you've got to let it cool. So here is what these look like when they are complete. Yeah. Fabulous, Ooh. very lovely. Wow, yeah. So you want them nice and golden and everything kind of all meshes in there together. And then we're gonna get to try them, okay? So. Sure. 
Good. There you go. And one over here for you. Oh. Yeah, this is they good. Go. Are they yeah. good, right? <laughs> These are yummy. So good. Yeah, so good, right? Mm. Have one with you guys. Oh, yeah. oh, thank you so much, Susie. You can get this recipe right on the show's Facebook page. But if you're not up for baking at the moment, and you still want to taste Susie's sweet treats, you can find some of the golden cakes available online for nationwide shipping.